I see men dangling upon the pikes of the sentence for life. Men prisoner like some despicable imprisonment and just like prison, good behavior gets you paroled. Maybe, just maybe that's why good people die early. We pray to a God to pay our price, but we pose potently to proclaim the price. We trade the blame but save the fame. We share the pain but what the gain. And this late man wonder the need to do good when the best of your attempt will be nothing more than the frozen flames of smoking ice. When the best of your achievements will one day become the fading whispers of beautiful memories. This brings men to wonder the need to do good, but answer comes in the mouth of a saint that says the only condition for evil to prevail is for good men to do nothing. The only condition for evil to prevail is for good men to do nothing. And in the end, we will not remember the voice of our enemies, but the silence of our friends, the echoes of the silence of our friends. So I bring you a turn from upon the coast of Tamuba, where 300 men save the moment, where 300 men save them all. Talking the sands with their sweat, turning the seas with their blood, they were spartans. All of them. Amen. That's God. The rising and the falling of empires, the making and the breaking of dynasties, the effort and the decline of anarchy has always rested on the shoulders of men. That's God. Even God to his own from the penury of death and hell, though he sought and planned as God in death to act, death triumph as a man, not as God. Remember the Alamos, they were men. Not God, A Hitler, they were men. Not God, for God and for country, they were men. Not God, God saved the queen, they were men. Not God, for the revolution, they were men. Not God, proud, they were men. Not God, Richard, they were men. Not God, Africa, they were men. Not God, who were men. Not God, 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 God,